First, as a helpful tip, try to use two different browsers or browser windows when accessing two different Gmail accounts. For example, use Google Chrome to access one Gmail account and use Microsoft Edge to access the other Gmail account. In this browser window, you'll see that there are two tabs at the top of the browser open. One is the current soon-to-be-deleted Wilkes email account. The other is takeout.google.com slash transfer. This is what you'll use to transfer your current Google information, such as emails and drive content like photos or video, to your new alumni email. Enter your new alumni.wilkes.edu email account and click on the Send Code button below. In a separate browser window, log in to your new alumni Gmail account. You'll see a Google notification email that contains a button to get your confirmation code. Click on the button and a new tab will open with your generated code. Highlight the characters, click on Edit at the top of the browser, then click on Copy. Navigate back to the takeout.google.com slash transfer tab and click inside of the box below Enter Code. Click on Edit at the top of the browser, and then click on Paste. This will fill in your verification code. Once the characters appear, the Verify box below should turn blue. Click on the Verify box, and you'll see a list of content that will be transferred from your old email address to your new one. Click Start Transfer, and you'll be redirected back to the portal login. Sign in with your current email username and password. This will bring you back to a Google verification page. Click on Continue and you'll be brought to a page that shows the transfer is in progress. Navigate back to your new alumni email address and you should see a confirmation email letting you know your transfer is happening. A second email will arrive once your content is fully transferred. you should see your emails appear in your new inbox. There will also be a folder or two automatically created under the Labels tab in the left navigation. You can also turn on automatic forwarding from your current Google account to your new alumni Google account. First, open Gmail using the current account. You can only forward messages for a single Gmail address and not an email group or alias. In the top right, click Settings. Click See All Settings. Then click the Forwarding and POP slash IMAP tab. In the Forwarding section, click Add a Forwarding Address. Enter your new alumni email address that you'll be forwarding messages to. Click Next. Then Proceed. Then OK. Go back to the Settings page to the current account and refresh your browser. Select Forward a copy of incoming mail to. From there, choose what you want to happen with the Gmail copy of your email. We recommend Keep Gmail's copy in the inbox. At the bottom of the page, click Save Changes. Another helpful tip in the transition to the alumni account is setting your current Google account vacation responder with a message notifying people of your new alumni Gmail address. To do this, open your current Gmail account. In the top right, click Settings and See All Settings. Scroll down to Vacation Responder section. Select Vacation Responder On. Fill in the date range, subject, and message. Under your message, check the box if you only want your contacts to see your vacation reply. At the bottom of the page, click Save Changes.